PCOM was founded on the principles of osteopathic medicine. Osteopathic medicine was developed by Dr. Andrew Taylor Still in 1874. As he practiced the medicine of his day, Dr. Still became unsatisfied with what he saw. Dr. Still developed a novel approach to medical care. This was based on the philosophy that all of the body systems are interrelated and interdependent on their structure and function for good health. He recognized that each individual consists of a unified body, mind, and spirit. He also acknowledged that everyone's body has an inherent ability to heal itself. Dr. Still emphasized that optimal health can best be achieved by addressing the neuromusculoskeletal systems in patient care. To this end, he developed a sophisticated approach of hands-on osteopathic diagnosis and treatment which he integrated into conventional medical care. He founded the first osteopathic medical school in 1892. This led to the growth of osteopathic medicine as it incorporated new medical ideas and paradigms in the years that followed. Osteopathic medicine has flourished since those early days. It has grown in many, many ways and in many locations. There are now nearly 40 osteopathic colleges with over 50 teaching locations across the United States. These colleges are educating more than 34,000 future osteopathic physicians, which is more than 25% of all U.S. medical school students. The Philadelphia College of Osteopathic Medicine is proud to be the third oldest osteopathic school in the nation, founded in 1899. PCOM boasts two additional locations outside of Philadelphia in the state of Georgia. Our PCOM Georgia Suwannee campus opened its doors in 2005, and our South Georgia campus, located in Moultrie, followed in 2019. PCOM has become one of the leading osteopathic schools in the United States. Our graduates are well-trained in all aspects of modern medicine, across all medical and surgical specialties, with a foundation in osteopathic medicine. These precepts include recognizing the body, mind, and spirit as a single unit capable of self-regulation and self-healing. This incorporates the use of hands-on osteopathic diagnosis and treatment to maximize the health of patients combined with traditional allopathic medicine. We encourage you to learn more about the osteopathic profession in general and the Philadelphia College of Osteopathic Medicine in particular. Our past is meaningful and interesting and our future is bright.